Okay, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my fourth tutorial. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how you can take this document and print it out so you have got a final piece of plastic coming out on the laser cutter. Um, this was the document that we worked on in tutorial number three. What I've done is I've saved it in the F drive, which is a um, USB stick, and I have connected it to the desktop, which is sitting just next to the laser cutter. That's where it goes, in there. When you put it in, it will automatically open up this dialog box. Click on that one. Click Mr. Doors 03, that's what mine one's called. And you'll get this coming up. I don't want it to sit down here. I want it to sit up in the top left-hand corner. So I'll click and I'll drag that up into the left, top left-hand corner. It tells me that it is 295 millimeters, as we discussed in the last um, tutorial, by 147.85. So I need a piece of plastic that's at least that size. In actual fact, if I drag a square around there, I will find that it's actually 310 by 160 millimeters or thereabouts. So I would need to find a piece of plastic that that's big, that, that is that big, or I would need to cut a piece of plastic that size. If you cut a piece of plastic that's too big, then you're just wasting plastic. If you cut a piece that's too small, then obviously it's not going to work. I happen to find a piece of plastic sitting in the scrap just to the left of the laser cutter, which will fit me, fit my giraffe perfectly. If you can see the way down there, that's 30 centimeters there, 295 millimeters. So I'm probably going to need to make it a little bit smaller, but it should work out just right. Okay. What you'll need to do is you go Command P and brings up this dialog box. The SDS001 is not the laser cutter. The Mercury 3 laser cutter is the laser cutter. Please click on Preferences and that will take you to these, this dialog box. Under Options, choose Manual Color Fill, 300 DPI, go to Pen. You'll see that the black color, which is the color we use to cut or vector, is set at 3% speed. 100% power, 300 ppi. That's perfect for cutting 3mm thick acrylic. The red button, remember, or the red color, remember, we had selected for the rastering or the etching. Okay, 95% power, 100% speed, 300% ppi, perfect. If we hit OK on that, that'll take us back to the print box and we can press OK, go and print. Before you do the OK, go and print, please remember to turn the laser cutter on, okay? Not just the laser cutter, but the filter, and I'll show you that in a tick. So turn the laser cutter on, and your teacher will set the table depth up to the right depth so that you can print. Make sure that the filter is turned on before you press go. The laser here is warming up, please wait. You can press the start button. Here you go, there's, the, there's Mr. Dawes, that's my, um, my document that's come up. I press the start button and I go. When it has fin finished printing out, you can see that it's all printed out there. When it's fin finished printing out, please just check that it has actually cut through. Sometimes if the, layer, if the laser cutter is not adjusted properly, it may not cut through properly. So don't move it until you are certain that it's cut through properly. If it is, as you can see here, perfect. You can take the piece of plastic out you can put it on the plastic bender and voila, you have a plastic giraffe with etched dots looking just beautiful. A couple of things I could have done, yeah? I could have continued to etch those hoofs in if I wanted to, but I didn't. I could have used that shaping tool and made these corners here less sharp before I attached it to giraffe and used the virtual segment to lead. I probably should have done that, but I didn't. Um, <laughs> I don't know, depending on what this was used for, I could have done a range of things. But remember, what you do on the laser cutter, what, what you do on Corel Draw is what will come out on the laser cutter. So try and make sure that what you do on the Corel Draw is perfect before you send it to the laser cutter. So you minimize wastage of plastic and everything looks perfect. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Enjoy your day.